Welcome to another match day vlog. It is the second London derby of the Premier League campaign, Tottenham versus Chelsea. Now, whilst I was bored out of my head during this international break, I was actually doing some two things during the week. So, first thing, I went to do a collaboration with CFC Alex. The link to his channel is in the description below. And here's a summary of what went on. Now, I'm joined by Sam Chipek, a Spurs fan. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. We are struggling, but the results are <laughs> You are struggling, but... The result, yeah, but you look at the results and we're winning games. We are winning games. We are punching above our weight so much. In the 1990s to 2006, 16 years unbeaten against Spurs. <laughs> yeah, you finished, you yeah. Like that. Have you finished? <laughs> what you do is, it's all for the short term. Because you have so much money to spend, Bearing in mind, Roman Abramovich has spent over two billion in your club, including wages. You've got a Russian sugar daddy pumping in a lot of money into your club. And then just like that, oh, all of a sudden your history starts from 2005. So yeah, uh, check out his channel. Um, link is in the description. Go on. Second thing that I did, which was last night, I went to do some filming for a particular big channel. All right, we're here with Sam, Sam Chipek. Go subscribe to his channel. Uh, I'll put his out here. You can go subscribe to him and follow him. You're doing a job for us today recording. Yeah, no problem, Thanks though. so much for doing it, mate. On Instagram, yeah, up. he's the best Spurs vlogger out there. <laughs> there we go. Thank you so much for doing it today. Game on, lads. Yeah, that's right. I did some filming for Thog Den. I mean it this time. Stop letting us down and predicting other teams, yeah? Because I'm starting to think you don't even support Spurs. You would just support any team that plays against us. Comment below what team you think my dog supports and uh, yeah, we'll get Patch predicts on the way. Now it's all down to you, Patch. Will it be a win for Spurs, a draw, or a win for Chelsea? I'm personally going for a draw, but let's go. Go! Whoa! Please, please get a result against those mugs. So yeah, let's get to that match. It's just going to be an edged one today. 2-1 yeah. to win, something like that. I suppose I can't complain with the draw. Man. I think the draw would be a decent result, but I would love to get, love yeah. to get a win today. The very first time I discovered you was when Chelsea, 100% Chelsea, replaced by Arsenal Fan TV temporarily, and you were mad Bournemouth and Southampton. I've got to say, mate, it's a pleasure to meet you on an occasion where I would not like to meet you. No, that's yeah. when I was a lot slimmer. Uh, well, I was still fat, but I was a lot slimmer. <laughs> Uh, I actually fit into this coat normally, and uh, Chelsea were shit. Apparently, we're playing okay, so I'm nervous. It's not, this, this is a type of game where it could go all wrong. Um, obviously, we've been on our bit run. It's going to be what happens. Yeah. But, uh, you know, I think we'll be okay. I think it's going to be, we'll be all right. I mean, listen, we got good. we got some weak uh, points in our defence. Obviously, we're starting fourth, which don't get me wrong, I rate, but it's a huge test of running in a game like this. Yeah. Well, obviously, after George Keeler was running his mouth about how good fourth is, I'll be interested to see how actually good, how good he actually well, is. Well, us Spurs vloggers take like to take these things in different approaches. Obviously, George is. Uh, Mr. Confidence, I like to play it safe. Okay, Part of the bus, okay, like, you know, okay, certain okay. style of play that once used to be. Once yeah, kind of once time. used to be. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You won trophies, mate. What can I say? Yeah, fair enough. Yeah. Um, what you, are you, so you're predicting a win, I'm assuming? I'll go 2 on Chelsea, I think. I'm going to go. I think we'll just edge it. Oh, it's, uh, it's, uh, go either way. You'll edge it or we'll edge it. I don't think I can't see a win. I see a draw. One you one. see a draw? Yeah. We haven't drawn yet. I think this will be our first draw. It'll be interesting. We'll, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. I'll say again. We'll see what happens. You're a Chelsea
that's just come in 10 minutes and we were just that close to getting 2-0 up. Yeah. Go on, son! Go on! Shoot! Shoot! Shoot. with the ball. No, you couldn't have somebody better with the ball, either. Close him down! Oh, God, that's for Laqueta. Oh, my God, clear it! Get into him! Massive snake emojis in between them. For whom? For William, of course. <laughs> He's a bloody snake. <laughs> Gear one for once at this part of the second half. Come on, let Harry go. The nerves are kicking in. Lovely right. ball. Come on, you 
second now. Any second. <laughs> yeah! yeah! What a game! Woo! What a game! So I'm here with only one THSC, yeah. Lily White TV, and a certain salty little individual, <laughs> CFC Alex. Right, you know what, we'll start with you first. Right, what happened then? Talk us through it. The defence, I mean look, frankly speaking, our defence just let them go through. We were leave, leaving them so much space. And you know, Ali, Son, when you leave, those type of players, Kane and Ericsson, when you leave them that much space, obviously they're going to convert it. <laughs> We've ended your, let's get straight to the point, we've ended your undefeated run. I mean, what's your thoughts on that? Must I mean, look, it's a wake-up call. Wake-up call. It's a wake-up call to say, look, yeah, okay, fine, we've enjoyed a good run, but look at Man City in their first season under Guardiola. You know, it's... Sometimes in big games, it just doesn't happen for you. Exactly. Yeah. Right, well, listen, we've ended your undefeated run. It's all good for us. <laughs> Love to laugh at you, but also I'll be nice. Subscribe to him. Link is in the description below, even though I may have said that already in my intro. <laughs> and now let's get on to the real people with the real yes. opinions. Come on, Millie Come on, Millie One Team. Just him. <laughs> right, who was your man of the match? Me, Sonny. That, that run to make it 3 0. Oh my what god. Come on. What Come a goal. On. I thought Sissoko absolutely lost it. Sissoko, not a bad shout. Not a bad shout. And one. I think Harry Kane, his hold up play. Every time he oh won it in the air, God. and they oh. now literally he outsmarted your keeper. His shot outsmarted your keeper, Kane. He just went for it, outsmarted him. Well, fair point. But I think Aurea deserves a shout now. Aurea. Yeah, yeah, I mean his defensive yeah, was pretty good. Yeah, but it's Aurea we're talking about. He hasn't got a brain cell so on the side of the next attack. Either way, though. Well, I thought Aurea played well, but yeah. I'm sure. Oh, big time, big time. Listen, this is just all down to watching highlights and replays. Then we'll, yeah. our opinions will be a lot clearer then. Yeah. But until then, subscribe to him, subscribe to him, subscribe to these two. Come on, you Spurs! Come on, you Spurs! And fuck Chelsea. <laughs> <laughs>